my god. Hello everyone, this is Charlotte here, and today we're going to be playing a new Backrooms liminal space style horror game called Pools. Which, this is just a demo version, so it's not going to be particularly long. But we're just going to kind of jump right in right now. Hmm... Sounds like we're going down a ladder or something. Forgive me if my voice sounds a little weird. I'm still kind of sick. Hmm. Oh. We got a camera. Oh, so that's the ladder we came in on. Yeah, I'll say it right now. This is a very pretty game. Um, this is made in like Unreal 5 or something. I'm not entirely sure. But, it looks really good. Probably because I've been playing a lot of PSX style games lately. I don't really get to see some of the more... Um, what should I say, like, the super realistic ones. Yeah, though. I could definitely, you know, I wouldn't mind living in this kind of area compared to, like, the typical backrooms area. You know, with, like, the moldy carpet, the ugly wallpaper, and the fluorescent lights. I wouldn't mind this, though. This is actually really nice. Okay, I don't really like dark water so much. But, I guess if you could get used to that. But... The more, like, shallow water over there? I like that. So far, this control's pretty good, too, for a walking simulator. Ooh, going through this makes me really uncomfortable, though. This water's a little too deep. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> I really do not like wading through really deep water. It's a little... Yeah, but it's really bright and shiny in here. So, how's everybody doing? I did pretty good. I made some dinner earlier, but I'm, uh, I don't think it was enough, so I'm kind of getting hungry again. There's a little mini-map, but it doesn't exactly show us where we are. I guess that's kind of right up here where we started, or maybe like some kind of exit. I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, I had some green bean casserole earlier that was... Pretty good. Hmm. I kind of looked at the trailer for this game, and apparently it's similar to another backroom style game I played, where you can actually go down, like, the water slides and stuff. That's pretty cool. Go over here first. Yeah, these stairs totally don't look safe. If you just got out of water, you would definitely slip and fall. What? This is pretty interesting. Wall art? Hmm. But yeah, these stairs are definitely not safe, especially if you just got out of water. This is a major slipping hazard. You would have to be pretty careful going up and down something like this. Hmm. I'm gonna go over here. You 
Usually these kind of games reward you for taking the darker path, though. That's probably what we're gonna do. Yeah, I don't like this room, though. He's... Yeah, I do not like this. Hmm. Looks like that might be bleeding back to the other central area. So, we're gonna go ahead and take this tunnel over here. Now, this game said that there's no entities. I mean, it didn't say there was no entities, but it just said there's no jump scares and chase scenes. <coughs> so, that's what I'm gonna kind of go on. Hopefully there's no casings. The heck was that? Uh... Hmm. Okay, I think I might have been wrong. Maybe this way. Yeah, I think it's this way that we're supposed to... No, this just takes us back. There's a ladder we can take. Okay. We can try to use this. And our big butt just broke it. Well, that's something. Ah, jeez. Well, hopefully that's not our only plan of escape. I'm gonna kind of take a look down here really quick, though. That is a big hallway. Yeah, this is some really weird geometry. Architecturally, this doesn't make any sense. But, like, it is a backrooms game. Ooh, I don't like this. This is really dark. Yeah, like I said, these kind of stairs in this kind of environment, this is a huge tripping hazard. What? Oh boy, we're going in pretty deep. Hmm. Looks interesting.
duck. Yeah, there's a duck. Quack, quack. I think this is where we're supposed to go. <clears throat> Ooh, wait. Let me get a screenshot. Yeah, this will be perfect for the thumbnail. Yep. Hold on. There we go. Oh boy, I don't like this. This is really dark. Oh no. I feel really sorry for anybody with claustrophobia watching this right now. Thank goodness I don't have that. But yeah, this would not be a fun experience for anybody with claustrophobia. Or fear of the dark. Ooh, jeez. Spiral staircase, that's pretty neat though. Question is, where does it lead to? Not a really smart idea to run up something like this, though. But it's a video game. Ooh! I think I know what this is. Slide! Yeah, I'm definitely going down this. Nice! <laughs> that was fun. I like that. Yeah, if more liminal space horror games do stuff like that, I'll definitely play more. It's kind of the little details like that that are pretty important, you know? Hmm... Take a quick look at the other one. Usually the place that looks the least inviting is the place you're supposed to go. Yeah, that just sort of, oops, excuse me, takes you right back up. I'm gonna go through right here. Oh boy. I really don't like this. Yeah, this is making me feel really uncomfortable. Oh boy. Um... What the heck was that? Ooh. We shouldn't be down here too long. This isn't good for my sanity. Oh my god. I do not like you. I do not like you at all. <sighs> that was... <clears throat> that literally made my stomach sink for a minute.
Oh boy, where's the next exit? Yeah, this ain't it. I guess we could trust it. Uh, nope. Ooh, that is really creepy. Turn around. Oh my god. Yeah, this is definitely new looking. What? Oh, no. Holy moly. Yeah, this is a big room. Well, thank goodness there's guardrails around those big holes. What? Ooh, jeez. I do not like this. I do not like this at all. That is a long way down. Are we really gonna do this? Shoot, I guess we are. I think this is the end of the line. Alright. Oh my god! Well, that's it for the game. Thank you for playing demo version of Pools. Wishlist on Steam to stay tuned for the full version. And I'll include a link to the game itself in the video description, so you can go ahead and do that if you want to try it out for yourself. Thank you, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye! And today's comment of the day award goes to Vanessa Sapphire.